So yes, we are riding the Yamaha R3 and this is actually my brand new, well not, it's not brand new, but my brand new bike, the Yamaha R3. This is my first ride, I haven't even started up, I haven't even turned the key on it. I, I don't know what it sounds like, it's got a uh, slip-on Acura exhaust, no baffle in, uh, they didn't even give me a baffle. And it's just so gorgeous. <laughs> I had to get it delivered here, and it's quite funny because that is actually my old school. Hey, I'm falling over. Yeah, so I haven't even started it up, I don't know what it sounds like, don't know how fast it is. The only thing I've done to it is if I go around here, and I do this. GoPro, start recording. Yeah. So hopefully the angle on that is pretty pretty good I don't know it's the first time I'm using it it's the brand new hero 5 session that I got for Christmas hopefully it's looking at me I hope so oh 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 I don't know what this is gonna be like it has a brand new rear tire so that's gonna be slippy as fuck it's really icy as you can see probably uh, it's really bright out really really icy so really slippy so I've got to go really careful really 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 well let's adjust these mirrors so I can see shit one thing that's already annoyed me you might be able to see that RNG sticker thing that side I hasn't got it that side, <laughs> but they're three pounds. I've already looked, so it's all good. I've got so many mods coming for this. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's just start this thing up. Oh, here we go. I've never heard one in person before, ever. Well, that's awkward. Have I got to have the clutch in? Kill switch. <laughs> Oh, well, that's weird. This is the first two-cylinder bike I've ever been on. That's quiet as fuck. <laughs> that needs to be changed. Let's turn that off. Yeah, that needs to be adjusted big time. Let's find out where this clutch is. We're going to two-finger it. Oh, it's instant. Oh, it's instant. Okay. Vice is going down. First ride on a Yamaha R3. Okay, I feel comfy. I feel comfy. Oh, it's so weird steering. Coming from my, my Duke 125, not having any of this. It's so weird having the, uh, when you're steering and shit. Oh, I'm going to have to be so careful. We're going to go into town. We're going to do my normal route kind of thing. Oh, the clutch engages so quickly. Look how icy this is. Fuck. Um, this is not a good idea to go right in today on my brand new bike. It's so quiet. I don't like this. Full system's gonna have to come. Whoa! I give you how slidey it is. It's got some uh, some small indicators on it. Oh, ah, uh, uh, my boot stuck to the peg. Uh, I haven't done my boot up properly, so it got stuck to the peg. Way. This is actually the first time I've been on a a big bike in well roads I know. So it's uh. It's scary. I stalled. I knew that was coming. <laughs> this is scary. I'm going to have to get used to that clutch big time. Let's find out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, yes, baby. Coming for my little Duke. Oh, this shifts. I'll do a video of why I chose this over everything else I could have had. And people will be like, oh, you'll get bored of the power. I still have my Grom, my 125. So I can switch between a 125 and this 320. So I, I don't think I'll ever get bored of the power. If I get bored of uh, thinking it's starting to get slow, I'll jump back on the Grom for a bit and realize how actually slow a 125 is. It's so smooth. But I, I'm going to have to get used to that clutch big time, because it is instant. Look how sexy I look. Fucking hell. Obviously this is a beginner's bike. You'll hear a lot of people say in America that these things are slow. And... For them it probably is, but coming from a 125 from being on that for two years, and then going on this 320cc bike, which has got more than double the horsepower of my 125s, this is enough power for me. <laughs> Fucking hell. It shifts so quick. Oh, this is amazing. I feel so comfortable on it already. Everything so, like, the only thing I think I'm not quite used to yet, obviously the clutch, is the handlebars. Now, not because of how sporty it is or anything like that, only because they feel very narrow. Like, I feel like, kind of, my hands are very close to each other. 
but that's just because I've already always had um, naked bikes in it, the, the handlebars are a bit wider on them, so I think that's all I can say. In third gear, just trucking along. I don't know, apparently, yeah, 11.22, so the clock seems right. It's done 6,000 miles. I'm in third gear, doing 20, 28. It is quiet, I'm not going to lie. It needs to, needs to be louder. I got the baffle out as well, so... No wonder they didn't need a baffle for it, bloody hell. Wouldn't hear the fucking thing. So yeah, gear indicator, speedo. This ain't no review, this is just the first ride, like, my first ride on this thing. Oh, it's so smooth, so smooth. Now... I have very, very bad wrists. From the gymnastics I've done, I've always like had bad wrists. I can already feel like a slight tension because I'm leaning forward a lot more than I'm used to, but I will get used to that, especially if I want to put clip-ons and stuff, which I do. <laughs> I love the dash on this thing. Absolutely love it. It's stunning. The whole bike's stunning, to be fair. Fuck, it shifts so quick. This is like a perfect city bike. Yeah, that clutch is uh, instant engaging, which I, I, I can adjust a little bit on play around with it. I will make this bike as perfect for me as possible. I am not filtering today. <laughs> no, thank you. Now this is actually, I've never seen a Yamaha R3 around, around here where I live, so this is the first one I've, I've ever seen and it's mine. <laughs> it does what I like. Ah. Now I might stall again. There we go, we didn't stall. <laughs> it shifts so quickly. Oh, I'm gonna get in trouble with this bike. So from a UK rider's expect uh, expective. This is this is quick enough for, for city riding. Especially coming from 125s and that. Obviously in America you can get whatever the fuck you want. And yeah, it's going to feel slow knowing you could be on a 600 or a 1000. But it is a perfect beginner bike. Like, it's got enough pick up and go. Especially for the UK roads. I'm cruising in third gear, doing 30 miles an hour. And I could easily be bombing it down here right now. Easily! Which we'll find out what we do top end in a bit. Oh, this is so sexy! <laughs> Alright, let's downshift this bitch, see what it's like. Okay, engine braking's there. It's decent. I hate this fucking shit bit of road. Yes, didn't stall. <laughs> you're indicating because you're in the wrong lane, so I think it's gonna do that. <laughs> I gotta be I gotta be careful because it's got a fucking brand new rear tire on it. And it's let me as motherfucking shit. <laughs> but yeah, I like this. Can we do a clutch this sh sh shift? Oh yeah, that's smooth. Oh, that's nice. This is nice, I like it. <laughs> oh, I'm, God, I'm smiling so much. I love this thing. Ah, oh, never late. God damn you. Go on, man. You're all cutesy. I've stopped. Hey, moped. Hi. Hey, don't go too close to him. There you go, there's neutral. Easy peasy, lemon muck squeezy. Damn, I look sexy. <laughs> <laughs> it shifts so good. So good. <laughs> look how sexy I look. Hey. Hey. Horrible tunnel, horrible tunnel, horrible tunnel. I can't wait for the summer because I'm going to get knee down and shit. Where's the indicator? There it is. Hello, come on. I love this thing. I can't believe it's my new bike. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. I can't see shit. Yeah, it needs to be a lot louder. A lot louder. You know me. <laughs> The Grom's probably louder than this thing. <laughs> I haven't got the money for a full system just yet. I'm cruising so easy right now. My hands are getting a little bit cold. I'm going to do a 0 to 60 test today. I'll probably do it tomorrow because with these icy roads, the conditions are shit, so there's not really any point. I'm never really going to find out the proper time I want to get, so we'll wait for a decent day. That'd be small rider friendly. I think it. 
like a perfect fit for me. Absolutely perfect. Right hand's getting a little bit cold, but I can deal with it, I think. That's my favourite sign, that is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know this is gonna sound dumb, but it is so much faster by 125, obviously. The only thing I want is just it to be louder. Yeah, I love the black on it. I love all the colours, to be honest. They all, like, it's a sexy bike. It is fucking sexy. But um, yeah, this one popped up. Super great deal I got for it. It just seemed like it's the first bike I looked at and fell in love with. If that makes sense. Obviously, there was loads of bikes I was looking at, absolutely loads, but this is the one that kind of it hit me and I was like, yeah, okay, I could have that one. And I did. I got it. <laughs> so this is coming up to the end of the vlog now. If you enjoyed this little video of me first riding this bike, hit the thumbs up button. If you're new, hit the subscribe button so you get to see more videos I've got coming for this thing and all my other bikes, really. And yeah, I will see you in the next one. Most probably will be on this. <laughs> and, um, yeah, peace. Okay.